if you are here, you are frustrated with a sharpshooter number nine. Trying to figure out why you've done it so many times and it ain't working. You've heard you can't do it with dead eye. You've heard you had to do it this way, this way, that. I'm going to bring you the true legit way to do it. We're going to do it real quick. I've already done it, but I am going to show you the easiest way to do it. And I'm going to do number 10 for you in the same spot you can do number 9. Forgive me, I have allergies, but I did want to get on and make a video for you guys. So without further ado, we're going to get right into it. The spot you want to be, guys, to do this. Some people say roads, wherever you want to be in Van Horn. And the reason is you don't have to deal with law enforcement. And I'd say 99% of the people in Van Horn use sidearms, not long rifles or whatever you want to call them. Okay? Van Horn is the spot you want to be. No law enforcement. Okay? So uh, what you're, what you're going to want to do, I've already been up here and raised hell, but we're going to go up here. Excuse me, guys. Bear with me sniffling and coughing. So, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come down here. And usually in front of this bar, guys, you're going to find a bunch of people. Um, like, there's three or four guys right here. Very easy to do it with them. See, there's a bunch of bodies and stuff. I was just up here lighting people up. Nine times out of ten, there's five or six people standing in front of this bar. So, what you would do to do the number nine challenge, alright? So, let's say you wanted to do it to these guys, right? You'd bust a couple shots in the air. What's going to happen? All of them are going to pull their pistols out. Now, the key is, you can use dead eye. But once you click out of dead eye, you cannot use it again or it will count as a reload. So if I was the one to do it to all these guys, I'm just going to do it real quick, and then we'll ride away and do it again here, okay? So I'm going to show you guys what you need to do, all right? So pull out your weapon. Bust a shot in the air, all right? Now they all pull their weapon. So now what I would do is I'm going to click one hand, two hand, three hand, four hand. Okay, now that would have counted. I just got all of them. Disarm, guys. That's how you do it. Do as many as you can in as short as time as you can. Alright, guys. So we are working on sharpshooter number nine. Three hat shots in the same dead eye. Painting your targets is going to make you shoot lower than you need to, so use your dead eye, and it'll be best if you do it in here, like this spot where these guys are sitting down playing poker. So you see, we got a bunch of guys right here. Everyone's alive at this table. So this That's is going to no be lie. the best spot to do this. So we got four chances, so we're going to use our dead eye, but we're not going to paint the targets. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's get this game going. All right. So let's do this. And there it is, guys. Real simple. Whenever you paint your targets, guys, it's going to make it to where you have to shoot lower than you need to. Very easily done. You can go pretty much anywhere on the map that you're going to have three hats. Just don't paint your targets. And you should be fine. Alright guys, if this video helped you in any way, shape, or form, please do sub and hit us with a like, follow, comment, all that good stuff. We got a giveaway coming real soon, so make sure you have commented on a video and make sure you are subscribed to get enrolled in that. Um, <clears throat> so it, it doesn't matter how proactive you are, it doesn't matter how... Um, you know anything like that as long as you have subbed and you are have made at least one comment you will be put into the drawing for the giveaway 
all right guys that's gonna do it for this video we love you as always evil rogue out we will be back with the live for sharpshooter number 10